What can you say about the game and the way your team played? Hey, I think I think my team played really resilient. We played a tough ball game tonight. Team full of shooters, and I thought my team got out there and they pressed up hard on them and made the shots hard on them. We had a couple kids hit a couple of tough shots in our face, but I can live with that with the intensity we play with on defense. Now, what can you say about the way that you guys played over this tournament? Of course, you you got to the championship game, but what what did you see out of your team this weekend? Now, I seen a ton of resiliency. Yesterday, we came out, we beat a team pretty good, and then we came in the next game and we got it handed to us pretty good. Like I told my team, I said, hey, guys, this is a come-to-Jesus moment. Let's go out here and let's let's realize what we came here to do and, and try to do that on Sunday. And that's what they came and done. Now, for those of us who might not have seen your team a lot, what are some of the strengths of your team? What, what do you guys do well? I think, I think my team, we shoot the ball extremely well. We play extremely hard every possession. And then our defense, like when we play our defense and we locked in, it's, it's really second to none. We can lock up in a zone. We can lock up in man. Whatever that game calls for, I think that I got the right group of guys that once they get it going, it's hard to, it's hard to get past it. Well, what, was, what were some of your goals uh, uh, for this weekend? You know what I mean? What, what, what were you hoping to see? For this weekend, I was hoping to come and do it, do what we did. I was hoping to come and get a championship. Mm-hmm. I was hoping to see my guys come and be more together because I got guys from a bunch of different high schools. And all of them, uh, quite frankly, when you get on the road, everybody's been the man on their team. So I want to see them come together and put somebody before themselves. And I think this weekend is one of the best examples of what they've done all summer so far. Now, how will you guys build on this? What are, what are some of the things that you hope to accomplish, you know, this between now and the end of the season? Between now and the end of the season, like I said, I just want that camaraderie between them to come together. I got a group of 10th graders coming playing in 11 and 12, so I want them to come and get some camaraderie so when we are 11th graders next year, we can play with anybody in the country, no matter what the tournament level is. So I just want them to get that experience together and build that trust together. Now my last question is, is about coaching. And what got you involved with coaching, and and what are some of the reasons that you that you're so passionate about it? Man, I'm passionate about it because first, I, first I love the game of basketball. Like I was a player when I was when I was growing up, and I like I like watching to see how my coaches did stuff when I was a player, see how they let people play, how they how how they respond to how the kids are reacting. So I'm just passionate. I'm just passionate about basketball in itself, and I've been coaching since I was 16 years old. I'm in high school coaching the other high school kids and stuff like this. This stuff wasn't around as much as when I was growing up, but like as much as it is now. So I really, I just, I'm, I got back into it just two years ago. So I'm really enjoying it, and it, like I'm really passionate about coaching because like it ain't nothing like a weekend in the gym and a championship Sunday.